Jupiter BS6 ECU flashing procedure. When we need to do ECU flashing with respect to fuel pump of Jupiter BS6 through right scan tool. If any Jupiter BS6 vehicle reports for starting trouble or running of complaint, ECU flashing need to be done. Important to know before flashing. Different fuel pump identification in scooter segment. Pumps can be identified easily by coupler design. Different ECU module identification in scooter segment. Jupiter ECU wiring hardness matrix. Now we will understand how to look into the connected diagnostic tool and initiate the process of ECU flashing. Check the version of app. If app is not updated, allow the updation of the app. Connect diagnostic tool to vehicle. Ensure that vehicle ignition key is on and engine is in off condition while doing ECU flashing. Red light will blink. Connect ride scan tool. Select the VCI number to connect the diagnostic tool with ride scan tool. Enter pin. After confirmation of OTP, confirm the connection. Check blue light blinking has started in diagnostic tool or not. If blue light is showing, start the diagnosis. Initiation of diagnosis or flashing. Selection of vehicle. First you need to check which EMS system available in the vehicle. Select particular model with EMS system. If it's found of Kahi platform for Jupiter, select Kahi. If it's identified as continental for Jupiter, select Conti. For n -torque, Zest and PEP Plus, select the model. After vehicle selection, go to Life Parameter. Verify vehicle frame number. Verify CVN with the matrix. Now we are going to start flashing process. Ensure the conditions as already mentioned in your app. Ensure tab battery charging is more than 30% before flashing. Always connect the ride scan tool with dealer Wi-Fi. Ensure Wi-Fi connection is strong before flashing. Ensure vehicle battery voltage is more than 12V before flashing. Always select the right model before flashing. Otherwise flashing will not be done properly. Any issue faced related to app not working or flashing is not getting completed, contact 1-800-266-8871. Select the software based on fuel pump available in vehicle. Initiate flashing after entering the kilometer. Let the flashing gets completed 100%. After completion of ECU flashing, switch off the ignition key. Switch on again after 5 seconds. Ensure to write the frame number after going to below screen. And reconnect the diagnostic tool and cross verify both the frame number and CVN number with life parameter. Then switch off switch on once. Can try to start the vehicle. Take a test ride of the vehicle. Confirm no MIL lamp blinking. Deliver the vehicle. In 
important note. Do not dry run the fuel pump, meaning the vehicle ignition should not be switched on with empty fuel tank or fuel level below the dead volume. Ensure that all vehicles have fuel level above dead volume before switching the vehicle on. Warranty of the fuel pump will be void if the fuel pump fails due to dry run. ECU, injector and fuel pump should be free from tensions and compressive stresses or other cause of deformation. Guidelines for flashing ECU. Strictly do not connect the mobile network during flashing. Do not flash the ECU on your own if HO communication not available. Before flashing take the approval from territory managers area service managers. Do not switch off the ignition key kill switch during flashing. Do not press the back button in tablet till completion of the flashing process.